It's a lot of major fire burning in Virginia Gardens. Crews working for hours to control the flames inside the building. We've learned several people were treated at the scene and one person was rushed to the hospital. And local 10, Janine Stanwood is joining us live now from the scene with an update on that first responder's condition. Janine. And we're still waiting to find out how that person is and who that person is. But I'll step out of the way and you can see this is the building in question. That three story building that according to residents has been empty for some time. Even though this fire has been out for a while, you can see crews are still on scene, including a Miami Dade crime scene unit. Sky 10 above the scene, you can see that investigators are still here. The investigation is just beginning. Firefighters are converging on the roof of this three story building. Smoke billowing. Dozens of crews are here, even entering through broken windows. We're told one person had to be rushed to the hospital. Video shows air rescue at Jackson's Ryder Trauma Center. People who live nearby are stunned. Just heard the helicopters and I and never knew that it was something bad going on. The response so big, all lanes of Northwest 36th Street near the airport had to be shut down. And as hours pass, the area is still blocked off. How this fire started and when is still not clear. Reports of injured crews surfacing just before 11 a.m. I'm scared, of course. Being scared because I don't, I didn't know what's going on. How the building is being closed for years. So once again, Sky 10 is over the scene at last check. According to Miami Dade Fire Rescue, this is a structure fire three alarm, which means a lot of crews are on scene. How exactly all of this started and what happened to that injured person is still under investigation. Back here on the ground, you can see once again, Miami Dade Fire Rescue on the scene. Police are also on the scene and you can see these lanes of 36th Street have reopened. As soon as we get an update, we will bring it to you. We're in Virginia Gardens. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News. Okay, today.